I'm Farrell Hale, state senator serving the Tennessee General Assembly representing Sumner County. Congratulations to the Gallatin Chamber of Commerce on a 100 year celebration. We applaud you and congratulate you for that. As a child growing up in Gallatin, I often visited the square and going to the different merchants, the clothing store, the grocery store, I often saw a sign display, Member of Chamber of Commerce. I thought that was really neat and spoke well of the merchants that had that sign. When I graduated from pharmacy school in 1970, I came back to Galton in 71, opened a business, and became a member of the chamber. And I've been a member of the chamber for 50 years since that time. I've seen what the chamber can do for the community as well as for the business community that it serves. During that time, I had the opportunity to become partners with Sam Rickman, who's here with me today, at Perkins Drugs in Galton. Perkins began in 1895, so 25, 26 years before the Chamber actually began. And I'm pretty certain that Perkins has been involved with Chamber activity from the very beginning of the Chamber. And I've got Sam here today. Many traditions have begun in Galton with the Chamber, and you in particular, and Perkins Drugs and the Chamber of Commerce began a tradition that continues to today. Talk to us about that. So. We, sure, we sure did. Uh, you know, when I came to Galton in 1964, uh, Perkins was a member of the Chamber of Commerce then, and I'm sure it had been for many years. The Perkins family had been involved in the Chamber, not only as a member, but in, in uh, various activities of the Chamber of Commerce. Uh, I later became uh, a member of the Board of Directors of the Chamber of Commerce and served one year as president of the board. So I got to be involved with the Chamber from early on in my early years here in Galton. But speaking of the tradition that we, served, we started here in Galton, uh, back in the late 60s, early 70s, Perkins Drug started a Christmas open house, to be, and we did that annually within the early part of November. And after a year or two, we, some other merchants uh, joined in with us and, and were doing the same thing. And it, the ball began to roll, and we got more and more. And we got to the point that it was just too much for any one merchant to try to spearhead and be chairman of, the, of that event. So I went to the chamber, and I said, look, this is something that the Chamber of Commerce can do for Galton to take lead in this endeavor, take leadership, you promote it, you do the legwork for all the merchants, and they did, and it became a great success over many years, uh, and grew to, I don't know, 30 or more people, merchants participating. Uh, they now call this event uh, Tinsel and Treasures, uh, it's still held uh, each November, and they have a great success. I think this, the Chamber doing this uh, was a great service for them merchants of Gallatin and helping them to promote the holiday season. So from Tennessee General Assembly, we offer our congratulations to the Gallatin Chamber of Commerce for 100 years of service to the community. And we wish you the best for the next come 100 years. I'm John Rose, and it's my privilege to represent the people of the 6th District of Tennessee. And it's an extra special privilege to be a part of this centennial celebration of the Gallatin Chamber of Commerce. For 100 years, the Gallatin Chamber of Commerce has been an advocate for the vibrant business community throughout Gallatin, Sumner County, and beyond. Since 1921, the Gallatin Chamber of Commerce has provided business education, encouraged community collaboration, and built a strong, reliable network for job creators. The Chamber continues to provide visibility for partner companies and strengthen our region's economy. Today, the Chamber not only encourages growth, but works with local leaders to advance the quality of life in the Gallatin area. With a motto of true grit, amazing grace, this group has made a tremendous impact attracting jobs and establishing successful business relationships in our entire community. After a century of work, the Gallatin Chamber of Commerce represents and remains the leading voice for local companies, small family-owned businesses, and the community at large. It is my pleasure to recognize and congratulate you on this important milestone. I wish you all a very happy centennial and an even more successful next 100 years. Happy anniversary. For 100 years, the Gallatin Chamber of Commerce has done such important and invaluable work to make life better for Tennessee workers of all backgrounds and walks of life. 
I want to, of course, recognize Kim Baker for all that you've done, Kim, to make this operation a success. You know, as a young Gallatin boy who was raised with solid Tennessee values, I know just how much a good paying job can mean to a family. So please know that the work that you're doing to give Tennessee workers the dignity and the sense of purpose that comes from helping them forge a family sustaining career is so critical. And I cannot thank you enough for your efforts to attract good paying jobs to help Gallatin grow to heights never before thought possible. So congratulations on 100 years and here's to 100 more. I can't wait to see what the future has in store for us. May God bless. Hey everybody, Governor Bill Lee here. I want to take a minute to congratulate the Gallatin Area Chamber of Commerce on 100 years. Since 1921, the Chamber has been an important part of Gallatin, offering resources for small businesses and fostering community development. Thank you, Gallatin Chamber, for your work to strengthen businesses and build community all across Sumner County. Your strong leadership will carry you into and through the next 100 years.